If you haven't seen this scam yet, um, I'm not sure whether it's a scam or an honest mistake, but anyway, this is a cancellation contract with a telecom and some of them are notorious for uh, trying to stop you from cancelling the contract. And like this one here, they, they say, if you don't fill in the paperwork properly at all, we, um, we will um, uh, not notify you necessarily, but we won't accept it and then, and then we won't cancel your contract and, and we'll automatically renew for another two years. So it's in their favour for you to not fill in the paperwork properly or not get it in properly. And, uh, but have a look at here, right? They say, email it to contact at besttelecom.group, right? And that's where you've got to send it to. Now, let me um, just show you on the keys if I, I've got that highlighted at the moment. So, um, Apple copy, right? And then, uh, and then uh, let's uh, go up to this search bar here, right? And uh, just for argument's sake, and I'll just go Apple V. Right. Now, look at what happened. Uh, it's gone contact at besttelecorn.group, right? So that's corn now, not com. Right? It looks like an M, you know, could be mistaken for an M easily, right? And, uh, and I'm sure that's exactly what they want you to do. Send it to the wrong email address. And then when, after they've renewed for two years, it's you in your contract. If you didn't email it to the right address, it's not their fault. And then they go, oh, hey, too bad, so sad. Uh, um, uh, we, um, uh, uh, we uh, uh, you know, didn't get your advice to cancel the contract. And so you're automatically with us again for another two years. Now, I've never seen this scam before. I've been in business for 20 years. I've never seen anybody that's managed to do this, right? Where if you copy that link and then you paste it in, it will paste in the wrong address. That is just, that is just unethical, you know, <laughs> and I'm sure I'm not the only customer who has discovered this problem. Uh, with their emails, uh, but um, uh, uh, and oh. <laughs> group isn't even spelt properly. Huh. Yeah, look at that. See, it's G R O U P there, and it's pasted it in as Q R O U P. Yeah. So anyway, um, if you uh, uh, want to uh, uh, avoid that situation, I suggest you check your emails from Best Telecom very carefully before you send them off a cancellation contract. So that's my advice. Um, and just, just to show you again, you know, there's nothing funny going on here. I copy that like that. All right, that's copied now, or rather it's highlighted now. And then I go, Apple copy, right? Go up here to the search bar just for argument's sake. Triple click that, so then I delete it, right? And then, and then go Apple V, right? And what do you know? Um, best telecorn dot group. Oh, it's not group. It's group croup. <laughs> so. <laughs> So there's somebody spent a lot of time to make that look really deceptive, I would say, um, because I mean, I type email addresses all the time and I hardly ever get them wrong, but I definitely don't get them wrong on paperwork that's really important for my customers to be able to send in to me. So uh, good on your best telecom. Um, uh, if you think this is a scam, like it, uh, share it, because maybe there's some other people that think so too.